Hi. Now for the second part then, we have got to find d2y by dx squared. And in the previous part, we got dy by dx. So we just need to differentiate dy by dx with respect to x again, and that will give us d2y by dx squared. And if we do that, again, for terms like this, you just do three times the 12, which is 36 and then you drop the power by one. So it's going to be 36 x squared. For the next term, minus 24 times two is minus 48. Drop the power by one and you've got minus 48 x, x to the power one, okay? And there's d2y for dx squared.